You're watching One Heart Live Carnival Special. Who is enjoying themselves today? Yeah! yeah. yeah. Slightly a slow reaction. I'll ask <laughs> again. Uh, who is enjoying themselves today? Yeah. It's a wicked show so far, and we have a revolving hot seat today. But Tipper Irie and Trudy Boy Juicy are staying put, aren't ya? Yes. Yeah. Um, all roads lead to Notting Hill this weekend, but it's not the only carnival in the world. Uh, here's just a few more. Check out the hit list. The Bahamas Junkanoo, taking place in the early hours of 26th December. The festival was thought to have originated during the years of slavery when slaves were allowed to leave the plantations over Christmas to spend time with their families and embrace their cultural traditions. St. Lucia Carnival, created in 1999 and taken place before Lent, there are two traditional festivals during Carnival, La Rose, the Rose in August, and La Magwit, the Marguerite in October. Salvador Carnival. Salvador Carnival is one of the biggest street parties in the world with two main parade areas, Barra Undina and Cambo, Grand Avenida. Cayman Islands, Batabano. Opened in May 1983, Batabano was created to celebrate the African history of the residents and the vibrant culture mix that makes up the modern day population. Rotterdam Carnival, Zoma Carnival. Meaning Summer Carnival, the first carnival was held on August 4, 1984. Each year, a new queen is elected to lead the carnival. Rio de Janeiro Carnival. The world-famous Rio de Janeiro Carnival is held before Lent. The first festival dates back to 1723. Crop Over Festival is thought to date back to the 1780s and is a celebration of the end of the harvest season in mid-July. Trinidad and Tobago Carnival. The biggest and most well-known festival of the Caribbean islands. The festival is an eruption of energy, bright colours, calypso and soca music. Listen, I am such a soaker head. I cannot mm -hmm. wait for carnival. And those are just a few of the carnivals, not necessarily a top 10 or anything, uh, but some, I, I'm loving the fact that we were seeing some carnivals there that I've never seen before, so that was brilliant. Um, my next guest, he knows a lot about the obscure uh, carnivals that many of us don't know, uh, such as Rotterdam, such as Paris, such as Berlin. He's a noted DJ known for his soaker shows in the run up to carnival on BBC One Extra. Uh, he's got a show on Bang FM, just like me some of the specialist shows uh, as well as showcasing his skills around the world big up dj qt2 hi i did not like that intro earlier you liked it <laughs> you liked it yeah you liked it that was fire that was fire you could just record it and then just put that's, it out when you're doing your dj in it that's one of my dj jobs now. i love it <laughs> <laughs> one of his jobs uh, Kitty, it's brilliant yeah. to have you here. Nice to be here. I'm so happy because we've been talking about this for a for while, a having minute. you on the show. And I said, I'm going to wait till our carnival special, yeah, you did. Uh, which you definitely. Promised was, it. I did <laughs> promise it, and here you are. And we're here. Um, so, you know, when did you kind of get into DJing and what you do? Because you're quite well known now, yeah. especially on the soca scene. It's been a while. Um, I've been DJing for over 25 years. Wow. From Technics, Decks, Vinyls. Um, collecting records um, from morning. I stole all my dad's reggae <laughs> records, <laughs> all his Calypso records, you know, everything he had. Um, and I just started practicing in the bedroom, bought decks, and then flew from there. 
Wow. And would always play soca, whether it was a hip hop set, a reggae set, whatever. I always played soca in my set. So. Uh, Tipper did something quite similar when he was younger uh, yeah. by being part of his dad's sound yeah. as well. So it's quite a similar string of stories the way yeah. uh, all of you guys and all of us have gotten into uh, music and the culture and things like that. Now, we saw there mm -hmm. some of the carnivals around the world, and I know you've been to. Quite a few. Quite a few, yeah. Uh, so uh, give me some uh, that, for example, okay, yeah. Rotterdam Carnival. Rotterdam is is amazing. Um, really? What's it like? Is the vibe... Because I wouldn't imagine a carnival you there, would you, you Trini? It's, it's, you, it's, would. Like, like, just, yeah. you would not be surprised. You'd be surprised by the amount of dreads that are over there, yeah, yeah. you know, and, and... Well, it's kind of that area, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's kind of that area, that sort of Amsterdam yeah. way, right? Of course. Yeah, um, but yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> kind of fell into that one. Got me, yeah. just got me, yeah? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, it, it yeah. landed, finally. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, so there are a lot of dreads out there. Yeah, I'm but the carnival itself, find. very structured. It's, a, uh, it's smaller than our, ours. And of course. Uh, many of the carnivals I've actually been to, but um, yeah, it's very nice. Carnival's actually cancelled this year. I was there for carnival. <laughs> um, it got cancelled due to a mild hurricane. Oh, but, you're kidding. But the vibes went on. There was party after party after party, and the whole weekend was a success. Really? So yeah. you you didn't care? You I were didn't like, care. great, oh, no, I'm no, loving no, it. No, 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 we had a time. <laughs> <laughs> so, talking of good times, you've also been to Berlin Carnival this year. Oh, Berlin is a madness. Yeah, he was out there as well. Berlin, really? Berlin. I missed that one, which yeah. I was gutted. Tell me, what's it like? Yeah, it's, it's good as well. It's, um, there's not as many soca trucks um, as any of the other carnivals. There's like one or two. But that way you kind of get everybody in one band and it's just vibes. The whole weekend is vibes. They they know how to put on parties. So, Trini Boy, you, yeah. you went to Rotterdam or Berlin? Yeah, I've performed at both of them. Yeah, I've been booked you? to perform here. Yeah. So I did um, Rotterdam 2012, like one of the first days a while back. And I did Berlin in 2013 with Kess. Oh, wow. So, um, yeah, yeah, I mean, my well, experience. Well, Kiss the Band? Kiss the Band, well, yeah. it was me and Kiss, a yeah. a million artists out there. Yeah. Really? Yeah, yeah. They, they oh, my gosh, I love I love yeah. the soca. Um, Tipper, so yes, you were just I saying love. that you're you're thinking of taking a year and just going to all the carnivals <laughs> yeah. around the world. it <laughs> looks really interesting, and I think it'd be amazing to just do that, you know what I mean? So maybe I might do it, but I'm always getting offers. So for gigs. Oh, yeah. <laughs> what kind of offers? <laughs> oh, for gigs. <laughs> <laughs> no, to go so and it's play. Hard. Yeah, to places, go and play. Yeah. So it's like, you know, I'm always getting offers to go all different strange places like India, China. Really? Yeah, I'm going do, what, to all do these your, places. Do your whole just, Saxon sound? Yeah, well, just performance. Just me and my DJ, me and my band. It just depends. But a lot of the time, it's really interesting in the places that I'm going now. You yeah. Know, it's different from... You know, once at a time it was more just like New York, Jamaica, whatever. But now I'm going into Asia a lot and places and, you know. And Listen, doing they're, they're there. huge into their kind of soca music oh, and things like that. I know China have yeah. a carnival that LMU mass band they're actually okay. performing at as well. Yeah. Um, yeah. And of course in Asia, even Dubai, isn't it? You've yeah. just come back from I've Dubai, from haven't you, Dubai. cutie? Yeah. Uh, there's a big Me scene too. out there, have ya? Yes. Um, now listen, Social is like, Adrienne is blowing up and That's I'm so good. pleased. Thank yeah, you guys. Uh, uh, Adrienne is saying One Heart TV is getting me excited about Carnival now. <laughs> Uh, Ron K. Lawal, hello, darling. I know her. She's saying, tune in to One Heart Live on OTV, live broadcast, Carnival 2015 preparations. Uh, Davis Coco uh, P. Dean is saying, big up, Sir Irie and Trini Boy Juicy. Che in the mix is the chef and DJ Cutie Too High bringing brilliant vibes. Uh, people are just putting pictures, stills of like you <laughs> and Ori and people like that. Listen, this is amazing. I'm loving what you're doing. Thank you so much. Keep your tweets and emails coming in at One Heart TV. Um, of course, you can uh, go onto Instagram. Who are you repping as well? Who are you repping? That's what I want to know. Which flag are you going to be flying on the weekend? Now, talking of flying flags, I've got another Trini flag to fly. I know it's quite Trini heavy today. Yeah, it is, isn't it? We've <laughs> yeah, got I'm like three. Where, where are you I from? Grenade, you know, I read Grenade. Yeah. Oh, yes. Yeah. Let's around. do a woo woo. Because <laughs> I, 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 I am half Caracu Canadian as well. Caracou, that's mm -hmm. right. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so uh, let's go over. Let's go out there uh, to the line, see what Ori's up to. Oh my! Oh sorry, I was covering for. Oh, I was covering for Cutie. My bad. Sorry about that. Sorry, need a DJ. He's inside, so I thought I'd mix it up a little bit. Sorry, bruh. Excuse me. Hello, my dear. How are you? I'm good, thank you. 
Okay, and what's your name? Diani Felix. Hello, Diani. And what does carnival mean to you? Carnival means to be free, to express yourself, and a little bit about culture as well. Okay, that's cool. And do you um do you have a favorite uh, like soca song? And um, right now, I really like that song, Saltfish. <laughs> Saltfish. Yeah, that's my favorite song. Saltfish. Yeah. If you don't know that, Saltfish. It's a wicked tune, that one. Okay, where are you from? Dominica. So you represent Dominica. Where's the Dominica? There it, there's a Dominican flag right there, I believe. Okay. All right, well, all right. You're wearing a lovely costume, okay? You've got to give us a bit of a twirl. Come on. Ooh, look, she's attacking me with the costume as well. Ooh. Easy, easy. Anyway, sorry, sorry, I got to focus on what I got to do. My bad. Okay, so, and lastly as well, um, are you going to go carnival both days? Yes, Sunday and Monday. Okay, then, and will you be wearing a costume like this or something different? I'm wearing something similar, a bit different, but something similar. Okay, that's cool, that's cool. All right, well, I'm going to let you, I'm gonna let you do your, your little bit of dance here, son. I've got another gentleman here who likes carnival as well. I pushed you out of the way. I'm sorry, brother. All right. I just wait to you. Real quickly, what is your favourite soca song right now? Real quick. WCK Boyong. All right, that's his one. We're going to speak to him in just a little bit. Back to you in the studio, guys, OK? Uh, don't go anywhere, because we've got something special from him as well. So we'll see you in a second, all right? <laughs> we were cracking up there. That was so funny. He's trying to take your job. I'm telling you, all, that's Ori, you know. That's we, Ori. We've got all a little, slight little beef anyway. Like. He listen, doesn't, he doesn't know about listen, it, yeah, no. I've got beef with Ori. <laughs> yeah, 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 I've yeah. got big beef with Ori, and he knows it. I don't even know why I asked him why, here why today, he here? anyway. Yeah, 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 I don't, I don't even know why. Yeah. What evs, isn't it? What evs? <laughs> um, now, of course, we're seeing so many sort of carnival costumes. We're getting in the vibe. They're out there cooking, eating shark, drinking rum punch. Yeah, they're eating, and we're not getting a food in <laughs> <laughs> That's not good. Yet, yet, yet. Yet, yet. yet. Right. Yeah. Yet. So what I'm going to ask for, actually, I demand, this is my Diva demands of the day. I want some baits and some shark in here, yeah? yeah. For me and my guests. Uh, when we're all there a bit later <laughs> on, hopefully they'll bring yeah. tickets already like, <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Um, now listen, this weekend is going to be huge. Marshall Montana is in town, isn't he? Uh, you, listen, I'm so jealous of this competition. Uh, take a look, guys. Win a chance to see the king of soca, Michelle Montano, live in concert here in London at the Eventim Apollo in Hammersmith on Friday 28th of August. To enter, tweet us at OneHeartTV and tell us the answer to the following question. What Caribbean island did one of the founding members of Notting Hill Carnival, Claudia Jones, hail from? Was it A, St. Lucia, B, Barbados, or C, Trinidad? Competition closes at midnight on Wednesday, 26th of August, 2015. Winner will be contacted on Thursday, 27th of August, 2015. Good luck. It's so yeah, Ali Buddy Carnival. Listen, big vibes in here today. Um, all right then, so that's the competition. You've got until midnight, Wednesday night, uh, to enter. So best of luck to you. Uh, guess what? It's break time already. The show is going so fast. So I will see you in a few minutes. Don't you go anywhere.